ask me why would they watch my documentary? This is what I tell my people. Okay. If you want to tell my story, you tell about a dreamer who dreams me and I first had a legal problem. It would not compromise after suffering challenges, after challenges, I lost hope. But I never gave up on that dream. I continue on and face challenges of being hacked by a part of being stepped on, and my reputation being attacked. Why this happened, my father, died three years ago. I returned to Vietnam to bury him. To went to bury him at home like he wanted it. Like he wanted to. And I got a girl pregnant and she delivered me a beautiful daughter. My mother disowned me because my grandmother went up the mountain during the Vietnam War and never came down. And my fiance is on the wrong side of the war. And my mom blamed her and my baby. My mom sold the house in Pembroke Pine that I was living and I was forced on the street. My siblings disowned me, not helping me financially with money. So my fiance could have like, and daughter could have like uh, food, shelter, and clothing. After they stole it, my name that I copyrighted, baby. I did not grab for their help. So I had to work three jobs to send to uh, my fiance and daughter while living on the streets. And now I'm living at Chapman Homeless Shelter. I continue to do my videos because I got a story to tell. And I think if the public knows my name, I will get the funds to make my dream come true sooner or later. citizens of the world is my strategy of creating buzz, hype, make me rich and famous, good or bad, no matter why my siblings were making millions using the unauthorized name, baby, it's an acronym, it stands for become a beautiful you, nail ball, without compensating me for my copyrighted name, which I I registered under the Library of Congress. I was going to bring baby into, you know, selling everything from eyelashes to nail polish to make fashion to canned coffee and a lot of other things, etc. This is a story of not giving up. and sacrifice to save myself and my family. It's the great Gatsby in the modern age. And I'm gonna get off, get the revenge for all the wrongs done to me. And teach my betrayer a lesson in business. But I'm gonna sue Chapman first. Because why I was in Chapman, I was boldly harassed and blamed by blacks and blacks because I'm the only Asian Vietnamese in their But you look at me, I will fight and I will fight until because I don't want 
my fellow youth that have gone through a hard time that become homeless and needs help to be harassed, bullied, and intimidated, and racially taunted. I probably end up dead before they even make the documentary, but I need my story told. And that's why, that's why you need to listen to my story. I want my life to matter. I want my life to have purpose. And I don't want I don't want the bad people to get away with what they've done to me. Because you know I deserve more. My baby daughter needs a more. The woman I love deserve more. Because My new video, if you want to see it, if you want to listen to it more clearly, listen to it on Facebook, follow me, friend me, share me, share my documentary, share my story, people. Love you. Love you.